Hey everybody! Welcome to Let's Pete Sudeke. We're actually on part 24. Can you believe it? That's ridiculous. Is it really? Yeah. 24. Nuts. Okay, and as soon as this robot makes his way past us, we are going to go into... <laughs> and this strong silent guy here. Yeah, just checking things out, aren't you? <laughs> um, we're headed into the Transentine Research Center. So, let's go. We did all of our prep last time, we bought some weapons, we did advancements, I think we did orbs, we fully explored the city, so we're heading in. Guess what? We head in through a super long tunnel. Surprise! <laughs> Just like every other dungeon in town in this whole game. Alright, so we'll get very used to seeing this room. It's kind of like a elevator room that sends us down. Alright, we must be pretty stocked up if I can't even hold that. Alright, and remember, we have five florins, so we're totally broke, so we'll see how it goes. Who's this fellow? I see you. Welcome to the Transcentine Elemental Research Center. I have been the Crane 5002, and I was invented by Professor Keeble. I ensure the efficient running of this complex. The only shortfall in terms of efficient operations is human error. Therefore, I'm afraid I cannot allow visitors into the complex. Regretfully, your lives will be terminated immediately. Thank you for your cooperation, and have a good day. Grand Systems, making life better. Well, it's polite, if nothing else. <laughs> Science always creates monsters. I'll ignore that comment. You're such an old-fashioned girl, Boogie. I thought you two promised to live and let live. I am proud of my traditional ways. My people would never train a dog to bite its master. Kahara the spider. <clears throat> Remember that giant spider that we had to fight that was literally killing your people? <laughs> oh. I think it has like a spear and a machine gun. And a cow catcher. <laughs> Holy cow. Train that bad dog, Buki. Okay, we can't put slow on him. Basically, none of the de none of the debuffs are working. It seems like so. Uh, we'll have to see how this goes here. Oh my god! 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 Storm kick. <laughs> okay. Let's get through this fight, and then we'll do a little planning. So, you may notice, too, there's this uh, additional robot up here. He's floating around. He's got a little uh, little eyeball hose thing. I don't know if that's Kren or who that's supposed to be. Um, but if you kill all the other robots, he will die. Let's see if I'm right about that. <laughs> there he goes. Where'd he go? He's dead. Okay. Little beach ball there. Um, or I think you can just kill him anyway, but it's fine to just, uh, kill all the cronies. So, alright. Let's maybe make sure we're on some strong weapons here if debuffs aren't gonna work. Histanica, sorry, it's not your time to shine. And I just spent all that money, too. Okay, the rest of you are fine. I'm gonna play as Elko so we can use that Neutron Blunderbuss, because that is gonna be amazing. Okay, I'm gonna get a little greedy with the items here <laughs> for reselling purposes. And uh, after that, we will head into the facility. So we are, yeah, and I guess I'll heal on the way here. Might as well. So we are inside the research facility. Kren has gone crazy, and we have to stop him. And I think he's got a crystal. So that's the side goal here. 
but it's really all about saving the people. Okay, uh, so this way appears to be green. It appears there's another way to go that's red. I'm going to assume we go the green way. Let's do it. This area is not Oh, humans aren't allowed here. Well, I never stop and take no for an answer, you know that. Oh my god, we're fighting in the dean's office. Fighting in the dean's office. Boom! Did that only do a hundred and some damage? Oh, there we go. So anyway, I entered the dean's office and I just started blasting. Oh, look at this guy. He's like flipping into the way. Statistically, your chances are not good. Yeah, you just had to get in there and take the hit for your homies. But what you don't know is I never miss. These guys are very strong. And you know what? They're basically Arcanites. So <laughs> they're basically just the Arcanites, but uh, with a different model. So now they're robots. But they're not robot Arcanites. They're just the Kren system robots, I guess. Okay, and they're dropping Omnium, so remember we need Omnium, right? When you kill a robot in cold blood, and you don't let him have his last phone call, he drops Omnium. So, super important. Oh my god, the music's creepy in here. Okay. Hey, we're learning some basic math. One is higher than zero. <laughs> Thanks, Dean. Um, <laughs> that's important, maybe. Let's see. Uh, anything else we need to know here? What's going on in this place? Is it... Is Elko the Dean? Why is there a giant picture of Elko? <laughs> uh, that's funny. Okay, let's check something out here. The last entry mentions storing the computer room in the safe, or the room key in the safe. Okay. Okay, 0101, 1011. Let's see if I can remember that. So, oh, Buki's getting her stretches in. That's good. <laughs> She's all set. Ready to kill some godless machines. Alrighty. Okay. So it was like one O one O, right? Was that a thing? Yeah, no, right? Am I wrong about this? Um, one is up, zero is down. Oh, it's 0101. Okay, <laughs> I did everything wrong. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's fine. <sighs> okay, 01, 01. This is binary, people. We're basically programmers now. Yes. Okay, this is only the first door of many. And then it was 1011, I think. So, one, zero, um, one, one. Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, this should be up and up. This kind of looks like the Death Star or something here. Very Star Wars y kind of door. Nice. Okay. Intruder detected. Yeah, intruder detected. Detect this! Pew. That's cool. That's a cool computer there. It's like decoding Krenz, uh, bad attitude or something. Oh, that's interesting. That blueprint, we might actually fight that later. That might actually be Kren. Um, cool. Oh, and it is a safe, too, so they've got, like, bags of money and stuff. I don't really know if there's much we can do in here, but we can get a few little treasures. Let's do it. Obviously, uh, this one will be nice, I assume. Wizard Wood Staff. Man, imagine if your treasure's so good that you put it in a secret bank vault and, like, turn it invisible, right? Ridiculous. Master key card, sweet. Okay, what's all this Wizard Wood Staffing about? Hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, I think this one's really cool. 
I think we're gonna have to use that. And uh, who's advancing here? Elko. Yeah. I'm going for essence these days. Okay. Let's go. Potentially get in a fight. Maybe not. Maybe Kren's turned peaceful. But if he hasn't, let's go use the wizard with staff on him. Oh, here we go. Nice. Okay, this is just like Elko's gun. Except cooler? Maybe? I think it's cool. Oh man, she can get like a three. Three hit combo there. Maybe more. You know what's crazy? I think these guys repair themselves too, so this can get pretty annoying. <gasps> He's doing it right now. I think little arms come out and like repair him. It's kind of cool. Come like off himself. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Look at that. Squick, st oh, stop him. Use your big attack. Yeah, cut him with your chain sword. Awesome. And there goes the beach ball. He takes forever to die, though. A little deer flies out. Okay. Cool, so that's a pretty sweet staff. Yeah, let's keep using that one. That one we might have to upgrade. Okay. Am I going the right way? Am I going the right way? I don't know. Which way did we just come out of? Because the red door, right, was locked, and now we've got the key code? You unlocked it with the key card. Awesome. Okay. Oh, Kren. You can't destroy me. I'm smarter than any computer. Alright, the computer room. Very cool fight our way through here. So, you know what? I'm actually going to attack this beach ball. Can I do this? Oh, he's fast. Yeah, we can get him. We can chip away at him. I, I should hit him with the bathos, maybe? Calm down, Elko. Yeah, it's not really any better. Alright, let's do... Let's do a couple things real quick. Let's do a... Oh, you know what? Let's let Elko die, and then we can do the revival move, maybe. Sorry, Elko. It's for science, though. I feel like you'd like that. You respect it, at least. I'm still gonna try to take this beach ball out. Oh, he's following me. Get out of here, you. He's trying to sniff me with his little sniffer. Will somebody kill Elko, please? I wonder if you kill him if all the other robots shut down. Oh, there we go. Oh, it does! It ends the whole fight! Well, that's kind of an interesting strategy. Okay. Hmm. has sealed off his central processing unit. I'll need to construct a decryption device to access it. I could use some of your magical know-how here, Ailish. Oh, you what? <laughs> Let's work swiftly. Ailish, you can help me. Now, take Boogie and find some raw mineral in the mine shafts. Run it through the processor and bring it back here. Hurry! Take the raw mineral through to the processor elevator. When you have enough, the elevator will automatically take the raw mineral up to the processor room, which can be found on the level directly above the mines. Then all you have to do is go to the processor room, process the raw mineral, collect the processed transentium, and bring it back to me. Okay, who now what now? Elko? Seriously? Okay, I know that sounds like a lot, and it's less than it sounds like, so don't worry. But seriously. I think this is actually still less confusing than the, uh, <laughs> than Shidani Mo's temple. Alright, yeah, anyway, we came in. I mean, this is all just decorative stuff, and, uh, there's Kren's door, so... We're gonna run this way with Buki and Tal. And I never got to revive Elko, so we'll have to do that later. 
Stardust vial. Okay, I don't think we've ever used that. Let's try it out. Stardust vial. There it is. Um, heals everybody for 500. Perfect. Just what I needed, in fact. Alright, so we're going mining. We got two miners here. I'm just kidding, they're over 18. Alright, yeah, down to the mines. This, You know, they mine Transentium in this town. Okay, two buttons. Uh, you need to activate the elevator's power supply. Oh, of course we do. Oh, I wonder who's going to do that. What? How do you do it? Oh, you sneak around the back. Climb over there with Buki. Of course you do. It's okay. You know what? She needs to have her chance to shine. I'm sure we'll be doing block puzzles in a minute anyway. That's cool to see those things punch through a little grate. It's kind of funny. Looks like a super inefficient way to climb an actual grade. <laughs> okay, power this bad boy on. Cool. Nice, it's got a very colorful and like, <laughs> like literally engine generator thing, whatever that was. Uh, I love the art style in this game. such a workout in this game. Jeez. Alrighty. Down we go. Let's see. Green for down? That's a huge elevator. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. Second level. Um, well... Can we go down farther? I feel like he said first you mine, and that's on the bottom floor? Three? <laughs> Does this thing go down even more? It doesn't. Okay. Three. So three must be the lowest level, I think. So we're actually in the mine now. Let's go check it out. Cool. Yeah, this is the right place. Alright. So we're going to go... Yep, there we go. Okay. So, this is a super fun room. There's like crystals here, there's this super crazy walkway, let's get a good look around here. There's crystals all over the place, different colors, there's all these suspended uh, tracks everywhere. Oh my, there's all kinds of stuff up there. Well, you gotta let me get up there. Almost reminds me of the Shadow Realm a little bit. I don't know why. Yeah, I'm gonna sell all this stuff later. Nice. I sold a bunch of those before, that's for sure. Okay, and then further down, yeah, so we've got kind of this main room. Look at this drill that comes up. And it's hot, and so it like gets like sprayed with water, and it cools down, and then it goes back in. We'll go check that out. Um, yeah, so super cool. Let's head in. Let's see what awaits us at the bottom of the Transentine Mine. Oh. Okay. And that's very creative. So, those are just aquatic laws, but they're robots. <laughs> very efficient. So, that basically lets them make the enemy once and then just uh, get all the battle programming and animation and rigging and stuff done and then reskin it for a new area. So, very creative. I love it. I'm a big fan. But I'm still going to kill them all. gonna get them all. I'm gonna dragon fire him, so I'm gonna do. Oh god! Oof. Oh, 
Holy smokes, there we go. Yes. That's why I'm upgrading Essence. I want those moves to hit hard. Yes. Okay, we're getting raw mineral? We need to get six raw mineral, it looks like. Okay. Doesn't sound impossible. But it is if I fight like this. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, dragonfire. Can't do dragonfire. <gasps> hmm. Okay, let's do a Cloud Frenzy then. Oh, what are these little things? What are these little drones? These aren't right. <laughs> They're cool sounding though. Minerals, three, four. I assume these must be the last two minerals. Yeah, let's get them. You'll be drinking oil at the Rusty Cog when you're out of commission here, boys. That's where shitty robots go when they're all washed up, you know what I mean? Oh, epic. Love it. Get that mineral. Okay, sweet. <laughs> that was fun. A hydrogenate scale, I don't even know what that is yet. Okay. The door opened and just dis disappeared, so that's nice. Um, yeah, let's just look around for fun. Uh, these little trolley carts here, look at them. That's where they go, and then they go up here, and they go to disappear. Yeah, this is so cool. Cool atmosphere in this place. Okay, let's look at this cool drill here, yeah. Yeah, it comes up hot, and they hose it off, and they cool it off, and there she goes again. Now get in there. Yeah, we're drilling for oil, boys. Drill's getting hot, though. Bring her up. Ooh, it's piping hot. This is insane. Okay, let's get out of here. So, uh, Elko's plan to get into the CPU room is to literally make a decryption device out of raw minerals. <laughs> and like hack the system so once again proving how sweet he is okay we got the minerals what do we do put them in the elevator there they go and they go to the processing room and then they show up on these little tracks that's neat neat there they go so much work went into this. Is that processed now? Can you put it somewhere I can reach it instead of way up there? Okay. Well, and we go to the processing room too. Next time on Let's Pizza Decky.